Let's, let's go back and think about that A36 Bonanza with the shattered windshield. Had that pilot ever thought about that being a potential? I don't know, but as a pilot, I appreciate him living to tell the tale so that I can kind of put myself mentally in what would it be like flying a Bonanza at 120 knots on an approach and have you know a 10 pound duck come through the window and break it. Now my face is all cut up. What do I do? Number one, maintain aircraft control. So let's kind of take that mental exercise a step further. You know, what was that pilot experiencing? A lot of wind in their face? You think the comms were clear? You think his headset was even still on? Probably got blown off. So now you don't have a window. You're effectively Nordo. It's at least sort of IMC in the cockpit now, right? We think about IMC looking outside. Well, what if, if, what if the conditions in the cockpit are so bad you can't see your own instruments? So kind of mentally think about, well, what would we do? I mean, I, I think that I could probably squat down, get below the glare shield, but now that's maybe causing other problems. If I am IMC or if I'm VMC, I'm making this sudden transition and I might be in a weird orientation, that might cause me to have even some spatial disorientation, right? I'm, I'm leaning my head back to try to get out of there. So I need to start relying on those instruments. What's the other thing? The, the wind is the big deal here, right? What can we do, if anything, to decrease that wind if, if we've had a, a bird come through the windscreen? 